hi guys welcome back to my channel today i've done this cranberry makeup look that's very appropriate for fall and this festive season if you like what you see and want to know how i got it keep watching for this makeup look i've mainly used my makeup revolution palette in run boy run it's a beautiful palette and it has a lot of warm toned shades that are appropriate for fall this is what it looks like it is full of mattes and shimmers i'm going to start with this light brown shade as my transition shade in my crease it's a matte shade and i'm working it into my crease and this will make it easy for the rest of the shadows to blend next i'm going into my mac frankly scarlet blush it's a beautiful red deep red blush i don't have a matte red eyeshadow which is why i'm using this this is what is going to go right into my crease with a nice detailer brush like so next i'm going into a duo fiber blending brush and with a little bit of that mac shadow i'm blending it into my crease to soften the edges and then i'm going into this beautiful shimmery cranberry shade from the same palette and working it into my lid on my lid Then using the duo fiber brush I'm going to blend both the shadows out. Now I'm taking that matte black shadow from the same palette and I'm working it into the outer corner of my eye keeping it very close to my lash line and in the outer V as well and then going back into the with the duo fiber brush I'm working it properly into the outer corner of my eye and blending it out into my crease. intensify the black as much as you want to to give it a smoky look then going back into that red shade again i'm just intensifying the color on my lid next i'm going into that pale pink shadow and buffing the edges out uh, on my upper crease and then i'm going to take that matte of white shadow and I'm going to use it as my brow bone highlight. I don't want a shimmery color as my highlight because there's a lot of shimmer going on everywhere else. I'm taking that beautiful melon copper shade and I'm just applying it in the middle of my eyelid and with my Maybelline Hyper Sharp Eyeliner I'm lining my eyelids and I want to keep this eyeliner very thin and with a tiny little flick, I don't want a very thick eyeliner, not something dramatic because the rest of this eye makeup is very dramatic as it is. I'm cleaning up whatever fallout might have happened. Next, I'm concealing under my eyes using the Maybelline Stream Lumi Highlighting Concealer and I'm setting the concealer with a yellow toned powder from the Bobbi Brown Concealer Kit. Next, going back into the same red blush, I'm popping that on my lower lash line and I'm going to take the black from the same palette and pop that on the outer half of my lower lash line to smoke it out. Dipping the same brush in the same shimmery red, I'm going to pop that in the inner corners of my lower lash line and I'm going to blend all three eyeshadows out completely very very nicely so the edges don't look harsh. Next, I'm going to go back into the same copper eyeshadow and I'm going to pop that in the inner corner of my eyes on my lower and upper lash lines. I'm using the Maybelline Falsies Mascara and applying a generous coat on my top and bottom eyelashes. I'm using a peachy golden blush from L'Oreal. I'm going to list the name down below in the description box. For a nice peachy glow on my skin, I don't really want much color. And to finish the look, I'm using MAC Cosmo which is a nice peachy nude on me. Because there's too much drama going on on my eyes, I don't want a very dramatic look. And that's the finished look you guys. I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial and will recreate this look for this festive season or fall in general. And if you enjoyed this video and have picked up a thing or two, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'll see you in my next video guys. Bye bye.